what brought you to come and see me? I think there were numerous things. I didn't feel as though I was in a good spot from a health standpoint, from a spiritual standpoint, from a being standpoint. And I knew that I needed to work on myself and do something other than what I had been doing prior and believed that if there was anyone that was able to help me get back on my path, it would be you. How was that manifesting in your life? Tons of anxiety. I wasn't sleeping well. I wasn't eating properly. I had issues with my stomach, with my intestines. I was not comfortable with my work situation. I didn't feel as though I was reaching my full potential at work, as well as dealing with a lot of grief and internally not being able to understand the struggle that I had in front of me. I had just recently lost both parents, felt very unsure about my future, and overall just not being in a fair state to, I was not about to go to my doctor and ask for sleeping pills and any sort of chemicals to put into my body. I wasn't prepared to do that. What was the actual experience like when you started having treatment? Well, the biggest thing that I noticed initially was my sleeping patterns changed very, very quickly. I was able to rest and relax and be able to calm myself down a lot quicker than I had in the past. I noticed that my um, internal organs, specifically my stomach, was a lot better than it had been prior. I felt that I was able to work on my anxiety a lot better. You know, from a health standpoint as well, I had, since my dad had passed away of cancer, I was extremely concerned about the possibility of having cancer and it being in my body. And, you know, my reaction to it initially before I started seeing you was not that of a positive one. I didn't really have that faith or belief that it could be cured or that we could, you know, work on healing my body. So that was another, you know, pending concern that I had in the back of my mind as well. When you were actually going through the treatment, what was the actual process like? The actual sitting down and having a treatment? I found it very soothing and very calming. There were components when you would be working on me where I felt the flow of energy and potentially the healing. Certainly it were areas where I, or I didn't anticipate it happening so very quickly. Um, but most definitely the overall experience is very, it's a very calming meditative experience for me. Uh, once the treatments are done, I always feel a little tired depending on how hard the treatment went or how much my body responded to some of the, you know, healing pieces that you were doing. But overall, I, I think it, it's, it's a very welcoming, warm experience. You had a, a skin condition. Mm. Do you want to describe that? I had a, a large mole on my right shoulder. And prior to coming to see you, I had been to my medical doctor. And my concern was that this mole was growing. She, you know, told me that she didn't necessarily think that it was melanoma. You know, there was a strong possibility that we would need to remove it. I was blown away because my doctor the mole or whatever, the growth on my shoulder had seemed to get a little bit larger and she thought that maybe we would be able to work on, I don't know, subsiding the size or and it was a little bit painful by some sort of medication. It wasn't an antibiotic. After 10 days of treatment, nothing happened. Nothing was changing. If anything, it was just more frustrating because nothing had had worked. So I had gone back and she had said, okay, we need to make an appointment to see a dermatologist to have the growth removed. So that was the second step. So after coming back from the doctor and sitting down with you and within two sessions, after the second session, about three days later, I was in the shower and I took a towel to my body and the growth came off. It just wiped off. Was there any residue or is there any scar? Absolutely nothing. There was no scar. There was no residue. There was no nothing. The growth literally fell off my body. What did you make of that? Uh, well, well, that was just a, a true sign of, of how your 
how your treatments do work. I, I never disbelieved that they didn't, but if that was not a true sign of how powerful you your your treatments are and, and how remarkable your healing works within two sessions, I, I don't know what, what it could be. The irony of it was that I had a follow-up with my doctor and the clinic that I was supposed to do just the minor removal had called me and said, <laughs> um, well, you know, you're, we're booking your appointment. And I said, I don't need to have an appointment booked. And they said, I'm sorry. And I said, well, I had done some other things and I had used some alternative medicine and the growth fell off. And this woman said, I'm it, it, what? And I said, the growth has fallen off. And when I went to see the doctor, I had showed her my shoulder and she was beyond, she couldn't, she couldn't believe it. There was no mark. There was no residue, no nothing left from this growth. Nothing. It was completely gone. It had literally fallen off my body. If it had not been for you or, or this alternative healing on so many levels, I mean, not just health wise, but with the component of assisting me with anxiety or centering me is the best way to put it. I don't know where I would be today. I have had incredible success at work. I have been able to really feel better about my health. It has remarkably changed my life.